Long time no see. <laughs> Hello. Are you going to say hey? Tell him. Say hey. No? Come on. Say hey. <laughs> He's thinking about it. Hello, I hope everyone is well. I know it's been a few days, sorry. All is well here. We have just been kind of hanging out at home, finishing projects in the house that needed to be finished, but I don't really feel or like beneficial or necessary to put on this channel, if that makes sense. I really try hard to like just keep my focus on advocating and teaching about Sebastian. Although I know there's a great percentage of you that don't mind what type of content I put out. You just enjoy spending time with us. But there are days where I feel like if I don't have any beneficial to teach you guys I don't know why I'm making videos I never want to make a video just to put it out so I try to find that fine line of like making content that is useful and helpful and beneficial and also just kind of letting you guys hang out with us if that makes sense we haven't had a whole lot going on this week um, and that's why I haven't really been posting but in the spirit of just checking in with you guys, we finally, after six months, put up curtains in both the master bedroom, our bedroom, and Sebastian's bedroom, which have been a godsend. Sebastian was waking up with the sun, like with the sunrise every morning around like five o'clock or so. And now after putting up the curtains, he's sleeping in until like 6.30 or 7, which is wonderful. I also feel like Gio and I are getting better sleep now too. Don't get me wrong, I love a good sunrise, but I also love sleep <laughs> so i feel like we all have been getting a lot much better sleep now that we have the curtains up we put some vents up like heater you know ac and heating vents up that needed to be up in the walls and then i helped geo on sunday put um, the rest of his lights up in the garage so he'll have to check in with you maybe on friday about the garage i'm not going to go in there but We've just been doing like little stuff like that. Sebastian did go to his grandparents over the weekend. He went from Friday night until Sunday afternoon. So that was nice for Sebastian to be able to spend some time with his grandparents. And then Friday night, Gio and I still went to our usual Friday sushi dinner date. It was just him and I. And then we went and hung out with some of our friends. There's like a little car show, like a little meetup. And it's basically like all of Gio and my friends, they drive their cars there and we just park them and we hang out and we talk and then we go home. So we were able to have a nice little date night on Friday and then Saturday I had a photo shoot for a previous client of mine and then I came home and cleaned my house uninterrupted all day Saturday it was wonderful but it's so funny because now today's Wednesday and I'm literally getting get ready to clean my house again like I'm about to do the floors over there and I have laundry it just never ends and I feel like I'm gonna contradict the intro of this video by saying I only want to put out content or I mainly want to put out content that's like beneficial and if I can teach you something about his syndrome but that's not going to be one of those videos today i just feel like it's been a minute since we checked in so i wanted to say hello i don't have anything informative to tell you today but i know it's been a couple of days and i've gotten a couple messages like hey are you guys okay is everything okay we are good I just tried to lay Sebastian down for a nap over here. He did not want to take a nap, which is fine. He just wants to hang out with mama, which is okay. So I'm gonna give him a little bit of lunch right now. He does have to go in his stander. We're still trying to do that 15 to 20 minutes a day. I have a meeting coming up this week in regards to school for Sebastian. So I'll have an update on that soon, um, what that's gonna look like and when that's gonna start. We're gonna try to get a plan dialed in for him. And then the only other thing that I did for myself today was I called the local gym to see if they were interested in doing a meet and greet with Sebastian and I to see if the childcare workers would be comfortable staying with him like a couple hours, a couple hours, I mean like an hour and a half to two hours a day when I work out. But I am the type of person, I just like to be super transparent. Like, yes, he's a five-year-old, but he's not your typical five-year-old. So his needs are a little bit different. But in saying that, I don't expect any of them to ever like change his diaper or like give him a feed or have to worry about his feeding tube. Like I plan all of my workouts. I try to plan my workouts around his schedule and his routine. So when he gets to the gym with me, he just kind of has to like hang out with them. But in having that conversation, I actually found out that the owners of the gym are friends with people from the church that we used to go to all the time. And I would like to go to more, but it's such a small world. I think it's going to be a great place for Sebastian to hang out while I start working on my my mental and physical health so we're doing really really good over here we're just hanging out right now say hi yeah I miss you guys 
I'm gonna get him some lunch because I think he's hungry. He's chewing on that chewy quite a bit. So we're gonna get him some lunch and then he's gonna hang out with me while I clean a little bit. He needs to go in his stander and then he needs to take a bath tonight. So if you wanna spend the afternoon with us, hello, you're probably not gonna learn anything, but it'll be nice to hang out. I just gave Sebastian the first his first little bite and some blackberries, blueberries, oatmeal, and banana. He always kind of hangs on to that first bite. I feel like he tries to like process it and then he's ready for the next couple of bites. You like that? Yeah? Is it good? I was wondering if it was gonna be too tart, but you seem to like it. Yummy. What do you think about that? Good? Nala's in the background. Hi, Nala. Hello. You're okay. It's a little tart. It's a lot of flavors, huh? Here, let me clean your mouth. Want some more? Yeah, good job. Nala says, good job. Why are you making that face? Is it too sour? Is it sour? Should I go add some more banana to it? Sweeten it up a bit? Let's try. You see how he's kind of grimacing a little bit? It's like he wants it, but maybe a little too tart. Maybe the blackberries weren't too good, huh? Want me to try something else or is it good? I can't tell. You want it. Yeah, you're doing a good job eating. What do you think? <laughs> Want some more? Good job, Sebastian. Yeah, you feel yourself swallowing? I think he's also trying to go to the restroom. Um, and when that happens, he concentrates very, very hard on that, so. Good girl. Yeah, good girl. Nala, can you say hello? Are you waving down there? Hello. Hello. I really can't tell if he likes it. I don't know. What do you think? Yes, you like it or no? You can tell me. Okay. Oh, he's working on something. <laughs> You're working on something. I hear it. <laughs> you don't want any more? Yes, no? You want that? You concentrating right now? Do you need to take a break? Let's take a break. <laughs> All good now. We just had to take care of something, huh? Hi, Nala. Hi, Nala. Hello. You wanna try? Let's see if you want some more of that. It's okay if you're finished. You didn't eat that much, but it's okay. Yeah, it's pretty good, isn't it? Yeah. Just want a couple more bites. I think these are more bites for taste and not hunger anymore. He is also having a milk feed right now, so. Would you like some more? Okay, let's go. It's pretty good, isn't it? What do you think? There you go. Good job. Yeah, you were working hard to get that out, huh? Yeah. Took a lot of your concentration and your focus. Did a good job, though. Yeah. There you go. Yum. Yeah, I see your tongue moving around in there. <laughs> it's pretty good. Hi. Love you. You want more? Yes? Hi. 
<laughs> Hello, I see you looking at me. Hi. I think we're done. That's okay. He did a good job. I'm not sure that he was totally obsessed with the flavor. The blackberries can be a little bit tart, so. Yeah, oh, is it a big breath? <laughs> Did your tummy full from your milk? Huh? You okay? Yeah, someone's ready for a nap. <laughs> is your belly so full now? Hi, beautiful. Hi, do you feel better? Yeah. I know now you're sleepy. Mm. I know. <laughs> It's a little too late to take a nap, though. If you take a nap now, you're not going to sleep tonight. Yeah. What? You can hang out and doze off a little bit. I'm going to go clean the floors. And then we got to work out a little bit in your stander. And then we'll take a nice relaxing bath before bed, okay? Maybe even a walk outside. How does that sound? Does that sound good? Yeah. Okay, lovely. Okay, lovely. <laughs> I just finished cleaning most of the floors. Sebastian's still kind of hanging out over here. And I was getting ready to take him on a walk, but there was a gust of wind so strong that it, oh, sorry. It literally knocked over both of these trash cans like they were standing there right here and they were all the way over towards the fence. So, and it's already starting to rain, unfortunately. So I don't think we are going to be taking any walks this afternoon. Hey, sir. Hi, how are you? You gotta get ready to work out, okay? You work out, not mama. Look at this big kid. Are we a little mad? Yeah. Here. Can you see that? Whoa. Yeah. Can you see that? Here. What do you think? Whoa, you're okay. You're picking it up, that's what you're doing. Yeah, you're okay, here. You're using this hand, is that startling you? You have two hands. Yeah, you're doing a good job. What do you think? Can you hear that? Yeah. Look at you picking it up. Good boy. Yeah. <laughs> you look so good. You want to try it again? Get your elbow out from underneath it. This arm is a little mm -hmm. tight, huh? Yeah, there you go. You're okay. You got it. You're gonna pick it up again. <laughs> go ahead, babe. <laughs> You're doing really good. Hi. Oh, it's okay. He's, he's complaining a little bit. He's doing a mixture of like talking and like kind of fake, fake crying. You're okay. Yeah. You keep startling yourself. What's going on? What do you think? You got it. Go ahead, ready? You look amazing. You're okay. I don't know, what is startling you like that? Is it this sound? 
Let me show you. No. That sound's not doing it. Something's startling him. I think it's... There you go. Whoa. <laughs> Good job, three minutes already. Whoa! <laughs> Here. Good job. You wanna try something with some lights? Here. What about this one? Go ahead. Scoot it forward a little bit. Yeah. Yeah, do it again. Find the buttons. Yeah. There you go. You're okay. Find the buttons. Yeah. You gotta press a little harder. There you go. Trying to figure that one out, huh? Go ahead. See that? Ooh, you guys, it's getting ready to storm here. Press it again. Go ahead, Sebastian. Give it a try. Blue. You're looking at blue right there. This one's blue. No, it's not. <laughs> Yellow! Good job! You've been standing for five minutes already. Look at you! You look amazing! You look amazing! <laughs> what? You like when Mama goes like this. Does that feel good? <laughs> He's at 10 minutes already. Ready? <laughs> Is that funny? You want me to do it again? So cute. I love you. you. Want to do one more time? <laughs> so beautiful. Five more minutes and then we'll go take a bath. Want to try something else? Yeah, good job reaching. Good job. Yeah. Can you hear that? Yeah. Yeah. Whoa, loud noise. I love listening to you. Here. Can you see that? Over here, over here. Look at him following it. Over here. Yes. And now down here. Yes, well done. Can you reach for it with your hand? Oh, big breath. He's getting tired. I'm, I've obviously cut and edit the video. I don't want to record the entire time, but I think he's at about 13 minutes. Our goal was 15 today, so he's doing good. Can you see that? 
Yes, good job. Over here. Up, up, up. Find it. Good job. Over here. Well done. <laughs> You're so smart. Do you want that? Good job, Sebastian. Hi. I see you looking at me. Hi. You just about pooped out. <laughs> you ready to get out of there? I think we're at like 14 minutes. I think we can call that good for today, huh? What do you think? I'm gonna go take a little bath. And take a little bath to relax. I did wanna take him out for a little walk, but goodness gracious, it looks like it's about to be Sharknado out there. I don't know. Mm, good boy. I'm so proud of you. Yeah, look at him trying to use that right hand. He's trying, yeah. You could see him just a little bit try to lift up and he's just just thinking about using that right arm and that's that's amazing. He's definitely left hand dominant. When he was brand new, he was born with a broken clavicle on this right side, which broken clavicles during birth, it's not uncommon. It happens more often than you think. Um, but because Sebastian was so sick and he was always in a, you know, in a swaddle or in a NICU bed or recovering from surgery or whatever, you know, whatever it was, um, we don't think that his right shoulder, the clavicle, we don't think that it healed correctly, probably just a positional thing. Um, but he has far worse range of motion on this right side than he does the left side. Um, so we think that it could be related to that broken clavicle he had when he was tiny, tiny. We just don't think that it healed properly. Um, but unfortunately, at the time, there were so many bigger things, bigger things going on. We were literally trying to keep him alive. He needed heart surgery. So it was one thing after another, after another, after another. And before we knew it, the clavicle kind of healed just where it was at. So yeah, we just got to keep stretching it. Look at Mama talks for a whole extra minute. You're good. We can go take a bath now. Yay! You ready? You ready to go take a bath? Let's go. <laughs> Listen to him. Tell me. Let's go grab a tubby. Come on. I think mama put one too many pumps of bubble bath in this tub right now. <laughs> and we got a big storm coming. Can you hear that? We have a little skylight up here. But Sebastian could care less because he's very comfy right now, so. <laughs> Goodness gracious, that stuff's coming down. Can you guys hear that? I don't know why Sebastian looks so like mottled. See that texture in his skin? That's called like modeling of the skin. He doesn't look like that in person. Goodness gracious, Bogey. I don't know that we should be under this window right now. <laughs> He's just gonna sleep through the whole thing. Did you guys hear that? Sebastian, I'm getting nervous now. <laughs> oh my goodness. So good. <laughs> oops. Oops, oops, oops. That feel nice. <laughs> Rub a dub dub, I guess. Whoa. That was a big thing of lightning. water. Mama's gotcha. You're okay. I'm just rinsing your hair. I know. He loves getting his hair washed. <laughs> yeah, he loves getting your hair washed, huh? 
Is it a little bit of baby conditioner in here? Yeah, that feels so good. You so handsome. Get under those neck rolls. Yeah. I love you so much. He's so cute. Wash it off, wash it off, wash it off, wash it off, wash it off. He's so beautiful. There he is. The storm is crazy, Sebastian. What are we gonna do? Feels like a movie and snuggle night tonight. What do you think? What do you think about that? Let me get a dry towel for your ears. Yeah, let me get a dry towel for your ears. Thank you, mama. Look at that, see? He's always got stuff coming out of his ears. Oh, I think, I don't know what we're gonna do. We have to follow up with the ENT. I know, that probably bugs you. Follow up with the ENT. Got a chronic, chronic ear infections. Okay, ready? You're gonna rinse your hair, ready? One, two, three. And here you go. Good job, honey. One more time. There we go. I know, I know. You gotta know something on your nose. You're so sleepy. Goodness gracious, you guys, that storm was crazy. <laughs> that was a crazy storm. There was like thunder and lightning and just lots of lots of craziness goodness gracious it was loud for a minute there huh <laughs> you love having your hair massaged don't you <sighs> they feel good <laughs> they feel good You want to do it? Help me. <laughs> Good job. Good job. Beautiful boy. What are you doing? You better get over here, mister. You better get over here, mister. <laughs> Come here. We have to get your jammies on. Come over here. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> what are you saying? Huh? Why is your voice so tiny right, right now? <laughs> Use your voice. What are you doing, goofball? <laughs> What? For those of you who don't know, we always cut a tiny little hole in all of Sebastian's jammies because we're probably not gonna recycle them with any family members. Um, and Sebastian uses his clothes for like years at a time and it just makes it more convenient. So yeah, we just cut a tiny little hole in his jammies and it works for his G-tube. He's all done. <laughs> He's laughing. <laughs> What are you doing? You crazy kid. <laughs> I'm going to give him his evening meds right now and then give him a little feed. And then he's going to get ready for bed for the night. <laughs> Your arm is stuck. This one is stuck under here. <laughs> Let me help you. Goodness gracious. All right, we're gonna do a little bit of medicine. Hold on. This is um, two milligrams of melatonin approved by his doctors, just FYI. And then we're gonna do a little bit of Keppra, which controls his seizures. And then, I'm going to start a little feed, get that belly nice and full before our bedtime. Yeah, get that belly nice and full. 
so you can sleep good in your own bed. Yeah. You wave them bye bye. You know, Mama's about to say bye bye. Time to go night night soon. Look how sleepy he is. I'm gonna snuggle with him for just a little bit. It's almost like seven o'clock over here, so I'm gonna give him a nice little snuggle. Try to keep him up until about seven thirty, seven forty-five, and then I've got one more load of laundry left that I'm gonna get done, and then Gio's gonna be home around like nine thirty or ten, and that's the day for us. Can you say goodbye? You say bye bye. You say bye bye. Like this, bye bye. Says, Mom, I'm too tired for this. <laughs> I'm too sleepy. Well, you guys, I think that's about all I have for you today. I know it wasn't a super fun or super long or super educational video, probably. If you're new here, you're probably confused, like, what the heck is going on? But thanks for spending Wednesday with us. I'm about to drain Sebastian's bathwater, get him into bed. I have two, one or two loads of laundry to finish. And then I'll probably take a quick little bath myself and we'll probably see you tomorrow. Say good night, everybody. We'll see you soon. He doesn't look like he's gonna go to bed anytime soon, but I swear he will. It's 7.45, eight o'clock, we'll roll around and he's gonna be like ready. <laughs> we'll see you guys soon. Yeah, say bye-bye. Literally two minutes later. He's ready for bed. <laughs> Alright, we'll see you guys soon.